Welcome back Pez Collectors. Today's video is going to be a fun one because I have a box here from Pez.com. Inside here is one of the limited edition Moon Girl Pez dispensers. And if you remember, I got the Cherry Pez Girl back in February. But now we have the Lemon one and I cannot wait to see this in real life. I really love the Cherry one. I keep her on my desk. Where's my knife? Let's open this up and get started. <laughs> in here too which I'll share with you as well let's look at this lemon girl first or er, maybe not first so you remember probably about a month ago I got these space mission pens from pest.com and I opened up one of each in order to put them up on my shelf so I bought one more of each because before you couldn't buy them loose so now on pest.com you can buy these loose so there you go I got another space shuttle another astronaut I want to have a full complete box set so I can have it for my shelf a Mars Rover. If you want to see these up close and out of the bags, then I do have a video showing these up close. And another astronaut. I did get two more Mars Rovers, and that's because I might go through here. I should just take these out real quick. So three, six, nine, twelve. Yeah, so these counter boxes hold twelve, and if you don't know, usually on the back of the boxes it does say down here. You know, that one says 12 count. So I'm gonna put these in and then I'll have, you know, three of each in this box. But I think it's really cool. And I'll just add two of these specials down to my floor display. But now, I like to make them random in here. That's usually how you get them. <laughs> So there you go, now I have a complete set of the Space Mission Pez, 12 of them in there, and three of each. So this would be really cool to have on my shelf for, you know, 20 years down the road, I'd be like, hey, look, I have a complete set. <laughs> okay, let's get to the real reason we're all here. Also, I bought some more uh, picture frames, so I'll do that at the end of the video here if you want to stick around and watch that. I'll put my press art that I have in those frames. It'll be something really fast, but it'll be fun. I can't wait to put them in there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Super cute. I like it. There you go. This is the brand new Lemon Pez Girl. So it says Team Lemon on there in limited edition. It does come with three packs of lemon flavored Pez candy. I did pull out one of my cherry ones. So there you go. There's a side by side comparison of the cards, which I think is really cool. And before I open it, I do have one of the Cherry Girls on the Pez International card. I did not get one of these Lemon Girls on the Pez International card yet. I will, but I just haven't yet. There you go. You can see what the card will look like. It'll be the same card as this one here with the Cherry Girl in it. It'll just have the Lemon Girl in it instead, which I think this card is really cool too. But I really do like the yellow and the design on this. It looks really great. There's the back. Nothing on it. <laughs> or I should say the born stuff. But let's open up the Lemon Pest Girl and take a closer look at her because I got to. I need to open her. <laughs> Feels so wrong opening the limited editions, but you know, you got to sometimes. So cute, so cute. What do you guys think? This is the brand new Lemon Pest Girl. She is wearing a little yellow Pez hat this time. She's got brown hair and she's on a really nice bright yellow stem that matches the hat. Still on the 7.5 made in China stem. I think she looks really great. I don't know. I really like it. <laughs> I really like the cherry one. Now the lemon one is super cute. I wanted to paint my nails yellow but I didn't have any yellow nail polish but I went with gold. That's pretty close, right? <laughs> So if you want to get all the package variations for the Lemon Pez Girl, you're going to want this one that I just opened. <laughs> and you're going to want to find her on this Pez International card. So check eBay or ask your Pez friends overseas to buy you one of these and ship it to you. And we still have another one for sure that we're getting. Probably more because, I mean, once Pez has a mold, it seems like we've been just getting repaints on all these molds lately. Which I'm not complaining, but it seems like we're getting a lot of them. <laughs> Because right here on the card, there's still another little girl there, and she's wearing an orange color hat. And as you can see, there's orange Pez candy in here, so I'm guessing that's the orange Pez girl. I mean, makes sense, right? So we're getting at least that. And who knows what other color combinations Pez will probably give us with the same mold. I can't imagine them retiring this after three, but I don't know, you never know. But let me grab my frames real quick, they're right here. I did buy two more of these. 11 by 17 frames. These are from Amazon. I can link this down below in the description in case you want to buy any of these. These are really good for 11 by 17 images. So 
usually 11 by 17 is a pretty standard size and that's like what I like to print on my my printer in here when I print out art. I can go larger, I can go smaller, but I think if you're gonna hang a picture on the wall, 11 by 17 looks really nice. It's large enough, but it's not too large. It's not too small. <laughs> so I've got those. I have to figure out what I'm gonna put in these still. I'm either gonna print out some more panda pez or then I think I'm gonna take some pictures of my raven pez as well and make some art with those since I like those a lot. Also got <laughs> box is so small. Oh yeah, okay. These are pretty nice. This seems so small, but I guess that's the right size. Hopefully this picture fits in there. I did buy this from the virtual pest convention. Not this past one, but the one before that when they had the art auction, which is my favorite part of the virtual pest convention. At least when they had the art auction. We'll pop this in the frame real quick. And then the other frames here I got were from the pictures I showed you in last week's video that was released on Friday. So if you want to see those pictures, maybe just go check out that video so we don't draw this out too long. This comes with the mat, but you don't have to use it. A lot of times these frames will come so you can use them two different sizes. Oh, it fits right in there. Nice. Oh yeah. This is so cute. I'm gonna hang this probably in the same area I want to hang other stuff. I don't know. Maybe I might hang it in my office. I need to figure out a place to hang it. But I love this picture. This is from Emily Davis. It's a little pony go rounds on a carousel. I think it she did a really great job on this. I think it's really nice. Eight out of 20. So there you go. It's limited edition. <laughs> and I could just set it up on something too, or I could put it on a bookshelf or something. That looks so good. But I have two more of these frames. I can also put a link in the description for these if you want to buy them. These are from Amazon as well. These are eight by eight. So eight inches by eight inches, which is also another pretty standard size. And these are 11 by 17. So I think I'm getting ready to start hanging my Pez art. And I think I'm gonna hang it coming up the stairs. You've seen it many times in my videos here if you watch me run around my house. <laughs> and you can also see it in my video I released on Friday as well. It's the art I'm gonna be hanging. At least I'm gonna start and then I can also add to it. I don't usually like doing that. I usually like to get a whole bunch and then hang it all at once. But maybe I won't hang up too much more than what I have. I probably will end up making more art or buying more art in the future. <laughs> I think it'll look really cool coming up the steps. Oh, and I wanted to mention that you can still buy the Lemon Pez Girl on Pez.com and Pez.at. It's not sold out yet. They did limit it to three per person per household and they haven't taken that off. So if you want one of these, hopefully it's still for sale because they will sell out. So if you want one, you know, buy one now. And did you see what Pez International posted for sale today? So that means Pez USA should be getting it anytime. Where's my phone? Oh no, my phone's in my office. <laughs> I have my notification turned on so that when the new releases do drop on Pez.com, I, I get a notification. But my phone is in my office and so I need to wrap up this video so I can go check. <laughs> but they did release these two Panda Pez. One's for Mother's Day, one's for Father's Day, and they are both cute. But the one for Mother's Day, it's got the tan stem still, but it has heart for the eyes. And then the Father's Day one has stars for the eyes, which I really like the black and yellow combination on that. That might be my favorite. I kind of want to take off the saying on the stem. <laughs> Or maybe swap the head with something else and uh, just have the heart eye panda. But those are really cute and those should be dropping on Pez.com anytime now. So if you want to not miss out on those releases, because I'm sure they're going to be limited edition as well, you might want to follow me on social media. I'm Erin Clucks Pez over on TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook. So follow me and I'll post on there right away when, you know, they're released along with other new releases as well. Just have your notifications turned on so you don't miss out. I guess as always, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in Thursday's video. Bye. I write to you.